20 years ago, the United States was attacked with the events of 9-11, where terrorists hijacked four different planes, which resulted in the destruction of the Twin Towers in New York City. Nearly 3,000 people lost their lives on that fateful day, and on the anniversary, the Student Government Association commemorated the names of those who passed away. Uh, today we're putting on a ceremony to remember those lives that were lost uh, in the attacks of 9-11. We'll be reading the uh, nearly 3,000 names that passed away on that day as a memorial and as kind of a respect and honor to those people that did pass away that day. 20 years after 9-11, we still remember those who lost their lives on that fateful day. Many college students may not have been born yet or too young to remember the events of the day, but the SGA wants to teach servant leadership here at Troy University and that everyone can do their part in remembering those who lost their lives on 9-11. Uh, it shows that we, we truly care and that we want to serve others and that we want to appreciate those uh, that have paved the way for us to be here. Most of us that are watching this, most of us that are Troy now, we're, we're barely even old enough to know what went on this day. And we're here today because of the actions that followed the leadership, the servant leadership that followed past 9-11, uh, to be able to secure our freedoms and to maintain our freedoms as a country. With Troy being known as one of the top military appreciation universities in the country, George says it's even more important to remember and honor this day and the people who fight for our country. Troy University is known as or one of the top military uh, appreciating uh, universities in the country and I think that's what oh, we're exemplifying and appreciating today with this as well. Um, our country uh, has shows strong patriotism and so does our university. The events of 9-11 sparked patriotism across the country and inspired many to join the armed forces. George says even though he was too young to remember the attacks, the lasting effects of patriotism inspired him to join the military. I'm going into the military once I graduate, and so I think this means a lot to me because um, the steps after that were to defend our country and to show that uh, basically you don't mess with the United States without retaliation. And the patriotism that was shown on that day is one of the reasons that I'm indeed joining the Army once I graduate.